I'm Bryn. I'm Hannah. And I'm Jade. Welcome to Eastern Regal Hairdressing in London. And today we're going to share with you some industry tips on how to do your hair at home. This is a video to show you how to get spiky hair or texture within your hair. It's really quite simple. All you really need is the right product and possibly some straightening irons. Rule number one, your hair has to be pretty short. If your hair's too long, the weight of it will, will keep it flat. You won't be able to get any root lift or any texture into it. You might be lucky, you might have quite straight hair and find it quite easy to get a spiky texture. Sometimes if you've got very thick hair, very wavy hair, it is a good idea to use a pair of straightening irons. If you find it easier, you may want to use a comb to help you get the texture or you could just use your fingers, which was what I'm going to do. Basically, pick up random pieces of hair. Go in at the root, not too close to the root because you don't want to burn yourself. And then just pull away from the head. You don't want to straighten every hair on the head because it will just look ridiculous. So go through, pick up random wefts of hair to give you a, an uneven texture. Some hair has different, different textures in the, in the hair. Through the hairline here with my model, we ha actually have a bit of a curl. So this is a really good example of how to, to change this texture. If you've got very thick, very strong hair, you could use gel quite happily to get a spiky texture. If your hair is quite fine or blonde and you use gel, it, it may make it look finer. So we tend to recommend either hair powders, which is basically back combing in a jar, or fibre matte paste. What you do want to avoid is pomades and waxes. These are gelatin and silicone based and basically they don't have any hold factor. I'm going to use a combination of hair powder and some fibre matte wax. This product lives somewhere between dry shampoo and back combing. It's very, very matte. If you use your fingertips in the scalp, you actually activate the product to get a back combing effect. The way matte fibre products work, when they're airtight, they're very moist. When they start to dry, the setting agent comes into play. To use this product correctly, make sure that you break down the product so there are absolutely no lumps whatsoever. And then I can already feel it starting to, to take set. You may be very good at doing your own hair, but the advice we tend to give clients is spend 10, 15 seconds and then just leave it. The longer you spend, the worse it gets. And that's the easiest way to get spiky hair. <laughs> 